Hey guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to new episode 11 of season 2 of Fire Force. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Smug smirk. Oh my god. I mean, does anybody else been to his room? I, I mean, come on now. But he probably has ways to hide that stuff too. Maybe, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we get to find out the truth soon.
Exactly. But honestly, you would think somebody in this group would go in his room and be like, oh, snap, what's doing in here? But you know, Victor gonna blab his fucking mouth to you know, Joker and everyone else. Um, wait. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> He's got to be doing the same thing that Victor's doing. He's like, mm -hmm, let me be, like, nice and sweet and two-time, y'all. Just as much as Victor is. I don't know. I mean. It's something. Well, of course, anybody would find that shady. That's it. Oh my god. So? Yeah, but I feel like his 
doing it the wrong way. It's, you're a bad guy no matter what. Right or wrong is like indifferent to you. Victor? So you've always been like that. He's weird, but I still like him though. And see, Joker is his temptation. Because we all know he's in the end. Yeah, well, there's nothing else you can really do about that. But then it would be too late to wait. up on the roof. He's fine.
thought you did some digging. Come on now. You're a bad guy. You do what you gotta do. Just to admire the scenery. Yeah. They're seriously not gonna lie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, if it was me, I'd rather just break in instead of just walking in. And only one remained. Speaking of which, my thing is, what the heck they gonna do?
god damn, just like that. I mean, he could have came out and kicked their ass and said, he's not cheap trick. <laughs> I mean, mm. You could kick him. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> I mean, I, I don't think he's dead. He's just knocked out right now. He's just going to be out of commission for, like, what, half of an episode next week, and then he's going to come back up and be like, mm, what the heck just happened? I don't know. I mean, I still love Benny Mudder. He's still one of my other personal favorite characters in this show. But, I mean, these two together, they're, like, the unlikely duo, like, the duo that we would never really see work together, but seeing them do this together, like, I don't know how to feel. I mean, it makes me still wonder, especially, like, what Benny Maru thinks and what he questions. Some of it, like, I got the context for, and then others, I'm like, I need a little more information to understand him as a character. So hopefully we do get another backstory on him soon, but I think this arc is only uh, three episodes as well before we get to the next arc. I don't really remember, because they released the poster for this, I think, Earlier this week or last Friday, I don't remember. But still, this is like the the most unlikely duo. And just uh, I don't know. He gave me like Yagi vibes and all me like <laughs> only because of the same damn VA. But oh, I don't know. I feel like now I can't trust it anymore. I mean, it's the same thing with Victor, but I, I couldn't trust Victor since day one, in my opinion. Hmm? But that hot is the kid possibly like another pillar? I don't know. I got no fucking clue with this. I mean, I love this show so much, but as an anime only, I'm like, what? <laughs> like, I want to read the manga for this so bad just to know what is gonna happen next and what every little detail, all everything that's happened from. The last three episodes to these next three episodes, what is it all going to mean for the rest of this season? But at the same time, I don't want to know because I'm like, oh, if I know, then I might end up stop, like watching the series as a reaction mashup and just watch it on my own just to be like, oh, okay, I'm excited for this or I'm excited for that. But I, I just, mm, I don't know. I mean, is Joker really going to leave Buddy Butter there for a whole episode now since he's like knocked out out of commission is? I don't know. I mean, and then what's his face is back? <laughs> oh my god! But I mean, I really thought that this was going to be a whole episode going into Victor's backstory and why he thinks the way he does. I mean, it just gives you like a little bit on him, but I still need a lot more to understand him as a character because he he's one of those characters that I feel like I know everything, but at the same time I don't. He's very very weird and different. And the way that he um, questions about what's right and what's wrong and certain things, it's just, like I said, this show goes into, like, so many different, like, religions, especially my religion, Christianity, a lot, and just, like, questioning a lot of things. And you're just like, oh, my God. But I don't know. I mean, mm. it's something. I don't know what it is, but it's something. And we ain't gonna know until next week or even till like, episode, what, 14? I don't know, something. Because everything that's currently happening, we're gonna get answers about it and what it all means. And hopefully, um, 
I forgot her name. Girl with the pink hair. She comes back because I feel like she is going to come back. Don't know when, though. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episode 11 of season 2 of Fire Force. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my subscribe. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode 12. Bye, guys.